Hey everyone, welcome back. Um, how are you? I did that intro all wrong. I I've been doing this enough that I should remember my own intro. You think I'm a natural um, born idiot? It's just because I'm recording videos back to back, it's kind of off, I guess. But let's try that again. Hey, everyone. Hey everyone, how's it going? And welcome back. Um, yeah, I just f finished recording my last one, so I'm trying to. If you didn't watch that last video, go back and watch it because you might understand more of what I'm talking about. Plus, I got some really good pulls in that video, so you might want to see that. I also screwed up a lot and made like 600 million mistakes in one video that's not even like 20 minutes long. So hopefully, we don't make any this time because at least my anxiety does when it stops making me cause when it stops causing the issues it makes me hyper attentive to not making mistakes again so i like double triple checked and i keep looking now to make sure everything's recording the link to the charities top description box below it would mean a lot whatever you can give it help it goes out to help people struggling with mental health and that's what this is all about so please give to that um hit the like button subscribe button the more this channel's pushed the more likely we're to help people um but since I didn't really get to show y'all the 10 in the last one because of all the mistakes, did I forget something with my intro? Rillaboom V. It's the Grookey box. I saved this one for a second because Grookey was my favorite starter in Gen 8. I'm part of Grookey Gang, and I really like Rillaboom. I think it's cool. This one we get to open up properly, unlike the last one. Hopefully we get pulls like we did last time. Oh, it's so nice to be able to do this properly for y'all. I keep checking to make sure I am recording. So that's why I keep looking over here. Plus, I look over at my cards at times on there. Um, as I mentioned in the last video, so if you haven't seen it yet, my the focus is really bad on this. I think it's the app that I'm using for my camera. So you're probably not going to be able to read the card. But um, by my next recording session, I hope to have that fixed. That's a, the Rillaboom V that came with it. This is the code for the Rillaboom V since I don't play TCGO. That's upside down. Since I don't play TCGO, I don't need it. So one of y'all can use it. But now I'll have the Rillaboom and Antelion V. It's really cool. I mean, it's guaranteed in the set, but still cool to get it. There was something I wanted to mention that I'd mentioned in the not recording of the last video. And now I forgot what it was, so. I obviously were saving that one for last again, even though that was a worse pack in the last one somehow. Because that's the highest value of all these. So we'll start with a sword and shield this time. It's not what I started with last time, but we'll switch it up a bit. Card, or the pack art. But, uh, what was it? I really don't remember what I wanted to talk about. Uh, that's going to stress me out this whole time, and now I'm not going to be able to talk much, because I'm going to keep thinking, and when I'm thinking deeply, I can't. I can't, um, now I can't think of what I want to say. I can't, um, really think of what to say. My mind focuses so much on what I'm thinking about. I like that card, Salazzle. I think I already have a Salazzle, but Metal Soul Star. I need to get a better way to store my cards if I'm going to keep doing this, but we'll figure that out at some point. Right. My while. Ponytail, Galarian Ponytail is really cool. Sobble again. I have a bunch of Sobbles now. Maractus, a Reverse Hollow Air Balloon, and a regular Wear of the Evil. Yeah, it was, there's no way we're going to keep up the luck from last time. But uh, if you didn't see the last one, I opened up one extra booster pack too because I want to balance out the three videos I'm doing today. So I want to make sure it's the same amount of packs in every one. I'm doing three videos because I don't want them to be as long because um, my video is not performing that well with retention it's performing well with views just not retention so hopefully if it's shorter the retention's a little better uh what did i want to talk about i hate having i have like some form of attention issues it sucks because i always that's why uh i don't know if i talked about it before i'm sure i have but i i like interrupt people when they're talking because i know 
if I want to say something, I'm going to forget what I wanted to say. And I know I'm going to. And I don't think about the fact I'm like, I'm not like, interrupt this person. It's just the way my mind works. It's like, I get anxiety about the fact that I'm going to forget what I'm going to, I wanted to say. So then I interrupt them and then I feel bad and won't talk for a long time because I'm worried that they're upset with me about the fact that I interrupted them. Even though it wasn't on purpose, it's not like I'm trying to be rude or anything. It's just the way my mind works. It's like so worried that I'm going to forget what I want to talk about or something. Because it's my mind's moving at 100 miles per hour. It's a regular rare. Shinodic? I actually don't know that name. I know the mind. I've seen it before. just don't know the name. But yeah, so because my mind's moving at a th million miles per hour, I move from one thought to another really quick and I leave the thought behind. I'm sure it'll come back to me. If not in this video, the next one. And if not in those, eventually, I guess. If it's important enough. If it's not, then it shouldn't matter. I changed my light a little bit again in between videos. Um, so hopefully that helps some. It was something I mentioned in the failed recording. And forgot to mention in the good one in the last video. And I'm going to be stuck on that for a while, so I apologize. Dottler. Oh, Corvusquire. I like Corvusquire. I like that whole line. Corvid Knight, Corvusquire, and all them. Great ball. Little cute little Vulpix. Nick it. Back to back fox foxes. That's weird. Ball toy. Chin chow. Crabby. A reverse hollow naked and a regular stone drinker. Oh, 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 sorry for the weird noise. I, you know, it'd be really cool if I could pull a polytoad. It's not even worth anything, it's not a valuable card, but then I could keep it with my polytoad. And I just quickly jumped from apologizing for making a weird noise to that for some reason. And who knows? I need to have more energy in these videos. It's something that I've that I want to get better at, but it's like I'm always so dull and my anxiety is so bad that I'm like down and it's hard to have the energy that I need. I get it when I'm streaming sometimes though, which is really cool. It'll like kick in and I'll just suddenly be a decent streamer. Not a good one, but halfway decent. Usually I'm just dull and like, uh, I'm sure that's how my voice sounds most of the time, like very monotone. I can't get this pack open, so do it this way hopefully this one's good because this uh, this 10 hasn't been good to us like the last one was we haven't pulled anything yet have we no well obviously we've pulled cards but we haven't pulled anything good we only have two packs left rapid ash last last video i was trying to take the back card out so i wouldn't show it to y'all i'm gonna try this way try to do this hopefully it doesn't hurt my hand too bad because I don't want to take the back card out because I'm going to keep forgetting to show it. And I don't want to forget to show it. This way I keep hitting the freaking camera and moving it though. So I'm going to try this. It will probably end up hurting my hand after a while. So I'll probably change back. But this is the best way to do it. This is how I would be doing if my hand wasn't broken. Another Chin Chow. As a rule. Oh, it's one of those uh, cards that's like knitted up. Like the trap inch card, not this one, but the other trap inch card that I tried to show before. It's like a ball of like a little yarn or whatever. Well, not a ball of yarn, but like knitted with yarn. A versatile trap pinch and a Flygon GX. And I have no idea if that has value, but Flygon's a beast. So I love it. You know what sucks? I want to get a like great reaction in one of these. The only thing I'm going to react to if I get like a hollow Charizard, because that's the only thing I really know that has value. <laughs> So like all these other cards are gonna be dull and like how am I gonna be a super excited I was hoping not knowing I would well in the last video and the failed recording part I got pretty excited about the Venusaur Snivy tag team because I was hoping not knowing I would get excited more often than if I knew but I feel like just because most cards don't really have any value to them I'll get excited about really cool ones too. Wait a second. Is this a normal full art or is this rainbow? I know in a... I don't know if this this pack 
set has the rainbow stuff, but in um, cause I know in Sword and Shield, you there's hollows and then there's rainbow hollows. If there, there's still rainbow hollows in this one, that means it gets even extra value. See, not knowing stuff can really help. I don't know if it's a thing, but it looks like rainbow. I don't know if y'all can really see. Yeah, it's it's showing up kind of well. Sorry about where the light is. I'm trying to figure that out too. It's easier to read, I guess, where the light is though. Um, but it looks rainbowish. I mean, it's more pronounced in the Sword and Shield packs, but that would be really cool. That wasn't much excitement, but that's because I don't know if it's rainbow or not. I'd be really excited if it was just a new. Um, this is, I don't know the card trick for this pack. I'm guessing it's, I just looked at it and it seems like it's, I love this pack set though. I'm about to buy more. They're really expensive right now, but I mean, it's like $12 a pack, but the art's the original art. I love it. It brings me back to my childhood. I want to show my brother all these cards. Wait a second. Um. I don't know if you're supposed to pull Japanese cards in the set, and I don't know if that's anything special. That's insanely unique to pull a Japanese card in a regular English Pokemon card set. I forgot to move these cards out of the way. I love this card now. Um, don't know if it means anything. I'm going to set this right here and check because that's really cool in my opinion. Even if it's a normal thing in there, it was a great idea by um, Pokemon Company. So, right there. I love that there's the original arts. It's bringing me back so much and then I'm remembering that I had all these cards. I forgot what cards I had. But I know I had like this Vulpix. I know I had the Rattata. I know I had this Sandshrew. Oh. Ooh. I got the Reverse Hollow Vulpix and Ninetales now. Is there a way you can tell that these are the... New? The X and Y evolutions and not... Obviously they're not base set. They're not... It doesn't say base, it doesn't have any of the set stamps there, and it doesn't have a first edition stamp there, so it's not those. But is there a way to distinguish it from like the regular cards from back then? Let me know in the comments if you know anything about it. Oh, that's what it was. Ha! Ah, I remember. I need to mention it. I was gonna, there's a couple things I want to talk about now, so sorry if I uh, go a little slower for a minute. But, um, so I had mentioned that. I don't remember why it came up, but I talked about the fact that I say, how's it going in the beginning of my videos. And I wanted to, cause I, oh, cause I, I don't know if it actually ended up in my recording now that I think about it. But even if, even if it did, sorry about that. It's my alarm cause I was going to get up to record, but then I got up before my alarm anyway. Hopefully I fixed my sleep schedule cause it's so messed up right now. That's the plan for this, but it's hard to be, I'm not really a YouTuber. But since I can't do anything else right now, all I'm doing for work is YouTube and streaming. So I kind of am at the moment. And it's hard to have a good sleep schedule when that's what you do. But um, before I forget, I say, when I say how's it going at the beginning of my videos, I'm actually curious. I want to know how y'all's day's going, how's y'all's life, how y'all's life has been, what's going on and everything. Um, I actually want to know. I want to be there to help y'all if y'all need to talk. Or um, it'll make me feel better if y'all are doing well too. Well, not two, because I'm not usually doing well. I was before I started recording the last video. I'm getting better now, though, so. I've, something about opening cards really makes me feel better. I'm going to keep doing this, even if nobody watches, because it's helping me. I'll still make other content for people to watch, because I want to help people, so I need people to watch. But I also have to help myself, because I can't help other people if I don't help myself. I almost start choked up there. I don't know why I was about to start crying. But, um... Yeah, so leave in the comments how you're going. Let me know how your day's going or week's going or whatever. Because I'm curious. Um, I, I, just, I say that for a reason. And that brought up me wanting to say something else. And I forgot what that was. 
I'm not gonna let that one bother me though. We need one other pack. I'm gonna do uh, the Rebel Clash. I wanna keep the Primal Crash for the other one. I've opened these before, so I kind of know. I have little tabs from me cutting off the top of my packs all over my... I guess you can call this an office. It's all over the place. Whew. Checking to make sure everything's recording again. But yeah, even if I'm not getting anything good, it's just enjoyable to do this. Especially those packs that bringing up my childhood. When I was actually happy. At least... I think I was happy. I don't really remember the last time I was happy, but... Okay, I remember every once in a while I'm actually happy. For a short period of time. Hour or two, maybe, but... Beware! Beware is, like, one of its Pokédex reading is when it, it likes to hug you, but when it hugs you, it, like, gives you a bear hug and crushes your spine or something like that. Something close to that. It was like, I would like a hug from a Beware. But I also don't want it to kill me. At the moment. At least. That's not where my mind is right now. Not while I'm opening Pokemon cards. Not too childish. But I've been doing a, a little better the past couple days. Which I talked about in the last video. Because I've been a... Uh, Phalanx. And uh Cramorant. This was a... This is so crazy. Last, If you haven't watched the last video, go back and watch it. We pulled... A hollow in almost every pack. I think all but one was a hollow in it. And this one we got one hollow. What is... I guess if you don't have the downs, you don't have the ups. So if you don't have the bad videos, you don't have the good ones. Why'd it have to be... See? I was in a bad mood in the last one. Had to be the good cards. Um, but yeah, the pools weren't great. But I feel like this video was better than the last one at least. So hopefully y'all enjoyed. Um, Twitter down below. Teespring down below. You know how important those things are. Twitch, very important to me right now because it's all I can do for to try to make money. Um, I've been streaming a lot. So go check that out. Chat with me. We can have fun. The Discord's down there. Come to the Discord. You can talk about how your day is. You can use it to play games with me. Distract yourself. Don't even have to talk about what's going on. You don't even have to mention to me that something is going on. Um, comment. Like I said, I do care about how your day is going. I don't just ask that as my intro for no reason I, I really want to know so leave a comment down below um if any of my well i only had one decent pool today if it was a good pool and you know let me know in the comments um as usual i love you all and hope to see you back here soon i have to remember to hit stop recording